The fully automatic polar type testing system has been designed for the testing of heavy plates, optionally flat material, or specimens from tube cutouts. The testing unit consists of the following single components. The robot for the transport of the specimens to the different stations. The specimen magazine for different specimen sizes. The specimen centering station for aligning the specimen. The cross-section measuring unit for the determination of specimen width and thickness. The testing machine won for tensile tests up to 1200 kilo newtons and the testing machine two for tensile tests up to 600 kilo newtons. Optionally, this can be very easily converted into a unit for high temperature tests of up to a maximum of 1200 degrees Celsius in manual testing. A heavy plate specimen for the automatic tensile test runs through the following sequence. Firstly, the operator sorts the specimens at the back of the magazine into their appropriate specimen places. Then the data of the test series are entered in the computer by the operator. Alternatively, this data can also be transferred automatically from a higher order host computer. The starting of the unit is triggered with the button on the operator panel. The robot takes the first specimen from the magazine and transports it to the centering station. Here, the specimen is aligned lengthways so that it lies centered in the specimen grips. Then it is transported onto the cross-section measuring unit. Here, four measurement transducers measure the exact thickness and width of the specimen. Then the specimen is transported on to the testing machine for the tensile test. According to the specifications, this means the 1200 kilonewton testing machine won in this case. First, the double-sided grips close. The extensometer is brought into position. The tensile test starts automatically, here shown in fast motion. and runs until the specimen breaks. In parallel, there are also tensile tests with the 600 kN machine. After the end of the test, both specimen remains are disposed of. Thus, the specimen has run completely through and the results of all stations are immediately available on the computer and can be further processed. Several specimens are run in parallel within the system. In extreme cases, one specimen can overtake another within the system. This has a positive effect on the rate of tested specimens. The criteria for the disposal of the specimens can be defined independently. For example, specimens can be sorted into different boxes depending on their tensile strength. Due to the arrangement of the device in a circle with the robot at its center, enlargement is possible at any time. For example, it is no problem to integrate a barcode scanner. With the test system, manual testing is possible at any time. There is no need for retraining, as for both manual as well as for automatic operation, the test expert software is used. Due to the high positioning accuracy of the automatic testing system, subjective influences are excluded. In the case of manual tests, these can have a negative influence on the quality of the test results, for example, because of different users. The traceability of the testing conditions according to DIN ISO 9001 is guaranteed. With the Zwick software Auto Edition 2, an automation module is used which meets the most modern technical requirements. Due to the low test costs per specimen, a testing unit with automatic specimen feed 
pays for itself within a period of about two years. Thick. Intelligent testing.